What's going on everybody on YouTube, man? Thank you guys for pulling up to today's video. We're gonna break down some of the most anticipated holiday releases from Jordan Brand. For the end of the year, we got some crazy heat coming out and we're gonna chop it up. And the first sneaker that pops up in your head that's your most anticipated for the rest of the year, please drop that sneaker down below in the comment section. Let me see if anybody's rocking out with my favorite pick for the end of the year, man. Also, I know you guys see the hoodie. This is a part of my clothing line, Unknown Collections. I would greatly, greatly appreciate it if you guys head over to my Instagram for my clothing line, Unknown Collections. I will link it right down below and head over to my website, unknowncollections.com and see some of the preloaded items that will be available for purchasing within the next couple of days, man. So please help your boy out, support your boy. Uh, we started something new. Still learning how to run a clothing line, uh, business in general. So any tips would definitely help your boy out, man. If you guys are new to the channel, right now what I need you to do is hit that subscribe button, ring the notification bell for your boy so you don't miss out on any other content. You guys know I'll be going crazy with the early reviews, early on feeds. And uh, you guys, I know you've been hearing about some shock drops coming very soon. So make sure you hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of that content. If you guys have been enjoying the content lately, please leave this video with a huge like, man. That would be greatly appreciated. We're trying to hit that 50K for the end of the year. We got about a month and a half to do so. I know we can get there with you guys' support. So like I said, we've been hearing about some shock drops for some sneakers. And the shoe that we literally just got a shock drop for was... Uh, these right here. It wasn't much of a shock drop. It was an exclusive access on JD Sports, man. JD Sports been doing this new exclusive access thing. I think you got to spend like close to 10,000 points to redeem that access. But I think it's very dope that they are letting you, you know, spend some points. You know, you spend your money to get them points. You can get exclusive access on some upcoming drops like these clean Air Jordan 12 royalties right here, man. Super nice, super dope. Uh, I really feel like, you know, they want to give us taxis, but they're just not there yet. So maybe we get the taxis within the next couple of years. Uh, but these right here, if you never had the taxis, you really love them growing up. These are a no-brainer that you should cop these right here. These will be released in November the 13th, retailing for 190 bucks. Let me know down below in the comment section if you are super excited for this release right here. I know I already dropped the review and I already dropped on feet early for these. So if you have not checked it out, please click the link down below. Head straight over to the full in-depth review and on feet over these clean Air Jordan 12 royalties, man. And the next thing we've been hearing about some shock drops for is the Air Jordan 11 Cool Grays. I'm gonna go ahead and throw that B-roll up there for you guys so you can check it out. We already did a full review over these, but it's been rumors that the shock drop is coming this week. You guys know last year when the Jubilees dropped, they did exclusive access about a month before the drop. And it seems like they're about to do the same thing for these Air Jordan 11 Cool Grays. So just stay tuned, be ready, hit the notification bell for your boy channel. I would definitely recommend you to go follow J23 and I would highly recommend you to follow Soul Links so you get notified as soon as anything happens with a shock drop surrounding the Air Jordan 11 Cool Grays. Those are retailing for two. 25 released in December the 11th. And if you do not know, Air Jordan 11s are always the most sought after sneaker around Christmas time, man. So if you really want them, start doing your research, seeing who getting them, putting them around for tickets to like Shoe Palace, DTLRs, and stuff like that. So you put yourself in a good position to cop a pair of these nice, nice cool grays, man. And then we also have the two pair of Air Jordan 2 Lows. I have to do myself some justice with showing you guys my Air Jordan 2s I actually do have in the collection already. So here's my first pair right here, the Radio Raheem 2s. Uh, this is a pair that I got for like $80 uh, with military discount and it was already on sale. But I was like, man, I gotta add me a pair of 2s in the collection. And I also have an all red pair of 2 Lows. I don't know where they are, but those drop around the same time the Air Jordan 3 True Blues dropped back in 2016, I believe. So the boy got a couple pairs of 2s in the collection, but you guys know the Air Jordan 2 off-whites are dropped. You got the black and blue pair, and you have the Chicago Air Jordan 2 Low Off-Whites, man. Super dope. I got actual, I got some visuals. I seen both of them in hand. They look nice. They look different, of course. It's an off-white distressed sneaker, and I think that Virgil and Jordan ran a dope collab with these Air Jordan 2. So please let me know how you feel about it. More on the hype side rather than the heat. I want to know all your thoughts down below in the comment section. The next Jordan we're going to be talking about is the Air Jordan 1 High OG Bordos. Kind of gave me the same vibe as the Midnight Navy joints that we got last year i think or earlier this year with the silver nike swoosh all bordo up top i really think it looks nice it's popping i cannot wait to grab a pair so some of these things i'm showing you guys are more on the i guess more hype side because a lot of people are talking about the sneakers so i want to bring this to your attention on when the drop is and stuff like that so these original one bordos will be releasing november the 20th coming up very very soon and i'm pretty sure they're gonna be loading up on the sneakers app 
and on the Flex apps very soon. So I know there's been some changes to the Flex app. I wanna drop a video about that when we actually get a release on there in my area. Lately, nothing has been there. So I didn't know what to make a video about actually trying to reserve a pair on the Flex app. So got the Edge on Bordeaux released in November the 20th, retailing for 100 and seventy dollars man we have another air jordan one these are the air jordan one gore texas a very different air jordan one I, I don't know what much to say about it i've never seen a sneaker or air jordan one like this before but these will be releasing a couple days after the Bortles, the 23rd, retailing for 170 as well. Actually retailing for $200, let me correct myself real quick, and I've never seen anything like this. So you guys let me know how you feel about it. Put a couple pictures up right here so you guys kind of see, gauge it, how you feeling it. Uh, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be some videos rolling out very soon, actually talking about the sneaker, why they made this shoe. I'm pretty sure it's because it's around the winter time frame, Gore-Tex, of course. Uh, but for me, I ain't really feeling it, but I want to show you guys, see how you are feeling about these Gore-Tex Air Jordan 1. And we have another pair of Air Jordan 11s. These are the Air Jordan 11 Animal Instincts. And it turns out these will be a woman's exclusive. So I'm pretty sure it's only going up to like a size 11 and a half or size 12 men. So all the big feet, you know what I'm saying? People that's like a size 12 and up, probably you're gonna be, you know, excluded from this drop right here. He's gonna be retailing for 225. If you guys did not know last year, I was going crazy over the Animal Instinct 1.0s and the 2.0. So I'm definitely gonna be trying to grab a pair of 11s with this all over Animal Instinct vibe right here, man. So super nice, super dope. They're raising the Air Jordan 11 price up, even on women's exclusives. These going for 225, just like the Air Jordan 11 Cool Grays. Dropping November the 26th. Let me know how you feel about it down below in the comment section. And now we have another little funky Air Jordan, man. We got another little spicy one, the Air Jordan 3 camos super different you know me i love those like i guess you could say military colors i'm not too sure so you got like those uh olive colors you got those dark greens and stuff like that and the camo threes are having all those colors into the sneaker so i'm definitely gonna be trying to grab me a pair of those they will be releasing november the 29th retailing for 200 dollars. so i know everybody hurried the retail prices for sneakers is going up to i think it's 200 everything i don't know but all i know is it's gonna be going up in price so these going for 200 already it's probably a special edition sneaker. I really like that camo all over vibe. I want you guys to let me know how you feeling about it. I know a lot of people might pass on these, but your boy definitely gonna be trying to cop these Air Jordan 3 camos. And I had to bring up the I'm on my year Air Jordan 1. So this is another sneaker I went to Kicks For Your Soul sneaker convention, and I was able to get my hands on some early sneakers. And this is a shoe that I actually seen in hand, felt the quality. And I must say these joints is extra, extra buttery as far as leather quality, man. So super nice. I love it. I'm a mere edge of the ones. I was not able to get the threes. So hopefully this go around with the ones your boy is able to get a pair of these joints, man. Super dope, super nice. Quality is immaculate. And like I said, the I'm a mere threes was dope, but the ones are to me even better. These are releasing on December the 1st, retailing for $170, man. Let me know how you're feeling about it down below in the comments. And then we have another crazy Air Jordan. This is the Air Jordan 8 Rua Hachimura. I think I'm saying that right, but I'm pretty sure it's like a special this sneaker with the player from the Wizards, if I'm not mistaken. So uh, crazy, crazy looking shoe. Your boy definitely gonna be trying to get a pair. I just like when they do different stuff, like all the different packaging, the special boxing and all that stuff. Your boy is definitely trying to go out there and grab them. I think this right here is definitely gonna be a sleeper, but long term going back looking at it in a collection i'm like damn i'm glad i got these it's a super super dope sneaker these are released in december the first as well and they are retailing for 225 dollars next guys we have the air jordan one handcrafted kind of gives me some biohack vibes i actually seen this pair as well it kicks for your soul senior convention i thought it was pretty dope just you know i wasn't going too crazy over but i know it's definitely a sneaker that a lot of people want to see definitely probably, you know, add it to their collection as well. These will be released in December the 18th and they retail for 170 bucks as well. Show you guys some B-roll of the sneaker that I got at the actual event and show you guys, you know, how they hidden, seeing how they might be coming to your collection and stuff like that, man. We also have the Air Jordan 4 Red Thunders. Uh, super crazy. You guys know that black and red goes perfect with damn near every silhouette and they went crazy on these Air Jordan 4s. I want the regular Thunders I uh, still have not got that retro yet. I think the last time it dropped was 2014, if I'm not mistaken. But these joints will be released in December the 23rd. I think the retail is 190 bucks. So 190 bucks, they didn't raise the retail price up on these yet. 
uh, but I definitely think it's a dope shoe. I know with some buzz around this joint as well, so hopefully we get some shock drops with some exclusive access going out on all these crazy, crazy releases in the month of December. And then last but not least, I had to save maybe the best for last. You got the Air Jordan 1 High OG Patent Breads, man. You guys don't know, Air Jordan 1 Breads is my grill. I still have not gotten it. Uh, the retail price is just too crazy. I don't see myself spending a thousand plus dollars on the breads. Now we have the patent leather version coming out on December the 30th. They didn't raise the retail price up even though you get like an extra hang tag, you get some special boxing, it's all over patent leather sneaker. They only retail for 170 bucks. So I know the buzz is high on those. I know the you know the hype and everything is you know up there. So if you really want these, put in your footwork now. If you know a couple of resellers, try to put it in the air now that you want these joints. I already know. They gonna get on sneakers app, they gonna fly off there. Then we are gonna be left hand to stock X or go. So I appreciate everybody for tuning in today's video, breaking down some of the releases for the rest of the holiday season. And in November, going all the way through December. And if you guys do not know, it's a bunch more crazy heat coming out in 2022. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you have not subscribed already. Ring the notification bell for your boys so you don't miss out on any other content. Head over to my clothing brand IG unknown collections and the website check out some of the items we have both those will be linked down below in the description box and with all that being said i appreciate all of support and i'm gonna catch you guys in the next video man peace